Hey boys, welcome to a different type of video. First off, I just want to say this video is not in any way intended to send hate towards C. Brady's channel. I'm just going to be addressing the one-sided claims he made in his video. Also, I don't want to send hate to anyone else involved, bro, and fastly crafted. Leave them out of it. I'm just going to be reacting to the video and giving my, you my genuine response and my genuine thoughts and actually what happened and straight up the truth. Um, there's no point for me to lie about anything and uh, I'm going to come clean to everything. So whatever happened, it happened. And as we watch the video, I'll pause and tell you guys exactly what happened. If C. Brady's side was right or if it was a little skewed or whatever you guys will see in the video. But um, I'm just going to go through the video, pause when I want to and talk about different things and um, watch this video through till the end until you comment anything, until you dislike, until you do anything. Um, just so you get my full side before you go and comment something that's irrelevant or whatever, you know. So I just ask that you watch the whole video through before you comment. Right off the bat, I just want to address the title, Using Fans for Money and Toxic to Friends. In parentheses, huge dick. So he went a little far. Um, obviously, I can be a dick at times. I say stupid stuff at times when I'm streaming. But um, it happens to the best of us. Uh, and he says, Using Fans for Money which obviously I'll explain, I didn't use them for money, but um, later in the video, once he comes to that point, I'll explain it. And uh, toxic to friends, I'll also explain that, so let's get right into it. It's, so we're gonna begin the reaction slash response. Like I said, it's gonna be as truthful as I can whenever he makes a point. I'm gonna pause it, and if I need to, I'm gonna explain my point or my side, um, because it is a one-sided video. I don't get, like, you need to make videos that show both sides and show everything that's leading up to it you know you can't just make one side that makes me look bad for your personal gain and not showing the side that actually needs to be showed so let's jump into this video and uh, see what happens oh the vape pre-roll okay i'll talk about this in a, a little later but you know yeah like i said we'll, we'll give this a talk in a little bit it's fine and um you guys are, are gonna have a sight to see here Yeah, we haven't been on, on the best of terms, but he came to me, and we're talking about um, one of the, the most toxic people I've ever seen. We in here, BB. Um, okay, granted, I'm toxic, but, like, you make videos exposing everyone and anyone you can for views, so, like, you can't say that I'm toxic when you, like, you're in the same boat, man. Obviously, I, I'm just toxic because I say dumb stuff sometimes, and I'm just, like, annoying, but, like, you're kind of in the same boat. Let's keep going. I know a little bit about him. I know he's a very toxic guy. Um, you know, I is bro. Is he blacklisted? Off I won't deny it. Like, I, I can be toxic. Okay, it's Minecraft. Let's go. Um, I thought he was for a while. And then they asked if I'm blacklisted oh, off Arcane. No, I, I don't think he is anymore. Yeah. So, so off yeah, I was never blacklisted off Arcane in my whole career. So. So, bro, um, he came to me with some very damaging information about we in here, BB. We in here, and I'm gonna. Um, we in here uh, was an admin on the network, and uh, we have a stream up. We have a stream up for you guys. I'm going to show that on screen for you guys, and we also have a video that we're going to be watching later. This is damaging stuff, so make sure you guys make it to the end of the video. I'm going to make this as short as possible, bro. Why was uh, why was we in here uh, demoted off Velt? Okay, so basically um, he was demoted and uh, he was banned especially too because of the fact that. Um, what he does is he'll live stream staff series, right? And uh, he'll do all that, you know, banning people. And people, will, he'll get kids to donate, kids in the stream, preferably like younger age. Um, okay, bro. Okay, let's finish it actually, one second. Assuming and the money for them to be unbanned and stuff like okay, that. Okay, so what happened? I was streaming on Velt. This is honestly 100% truth. I will be straight up honest. I'm trying to be as genuine as I can. I'm not going to lie about this. There's no point, okay? I was streaming on Velt, this guy referable, you can talk to him if you want, whatever, you can DM him on Twitter. Um, he donated me money out of the kindness of his heart. I didn't ask him for anything, okay, that's what streams, ha it happens on stream, they donate money, okay. And at this point, he's probably at about $50 total. And he asked me to unban him or his friend or something. It was along the lines of that, and I unbanned him because I thought, you know, why not? He's donated so much money, and if they want to come towards me for the money, I'll give them the money. It's as simple as that. But he's paid me that amount of money. I didn't ask him. I didn't say, hey, donate this money, and I'll unban you. He donated an insane amount, 
and on like 50 or 100 dollars he said can i get an unban and i was like i mean it's one unban sure and then he asked for a couple friends and i was like i mean i guess i mean in my mind obviously i knew it wasn't the greatest thing to do but i was giving back to him it's three unbans plus i can pay back the money if they want it and um, it's not that big a deal, okay? It's three Minecraft unbans. I know you're, like, I didn't advertise on my stream that I was un selling unbans, okay? They're, they're fully blowing it out of the water. And um, he donated out the kindness of his heart, and I decided to give him the ranks, which um, in my, it's a little bit of my bad in my opinion. Or it's obviously bad in my opinion, but they blew it out of the water saying that I offered for people to get unbans by giving me money. I did not do that in any way, shape, or form like that so what he was doing is he was essentially having uh people donate just to be unbanned and uh, like this one he told me this one guy donated one person yeah here it comes players, and uh he uh, he ended up unbanning his friend or whatever and i mean as you guys know like yeah he donated a hundred dollars like i said and that's the only thing he wanted was a minecraft unban that cost fifteen dollars and a couple of his friends which is in total it's about fifty dollars obviously you like admins can't sell ranks or unbanned. Like that's just not. A, that's just like a common sense thing. You know, you just can't do that. So he's basically using his fans to. I'm not using my fans, dude. But um, yeah. Obviously, I know I'm in the wrong in that, and um, I apologize for that. I really do. It was a stupid decision, but when someone's donated you that amount of money, the least you can do is something and just give them back something. And that's how I thought. And um, that might be wrong, and I apologize. Like I said, but I didn't. Definitely did not use my fans to the extent at all i didn't use my fans at all like this uh, they're saying that i did and i didn't it's just straight up a lie uh for money to sell uh sell unbans and stuff and abuse his rank so that's why he was banned now if uh if cbd wants to play the stream too um what happened was i was on this stream uh this guy said at wiener baby can you please unban me you know and i said at wiener baby is no longer a admin on the Valve pvp network and that was it i may have said lol or something but i'd really uh, that was that was pretty much it and uh, his reaction to that is uh, about to be played if C Brady wants to play that. Yeah, let's go ahead. We're at the 550 mark. I'm just going to go ahead and play this for you guys. Cringe. I can't really go on team speak because I'm a little too laggy. No longer has admin on belt, so we can't unban. Why did not? Why did I get my admin taken away? You're. And in my mind, I thought I got. I didn't know what I did wrong because, like I said, I was doing it out of the kindness of my heart. Or he donated me, so I gave him the rank. Because that's all he wanted. So I thought, you know, it's not that big a deal. If they want the money and everything, I can give them the money. We can sort it out. And um, either I can get demoted or whatever. I can get demoted, give them the money, and just be done with it. But um, So in my mind, I just let that go. It was all in the past. So right here, I wasn't thinking. I was like, why am I demoted? I had no clue why I was demoted. And that's the genuine truth. Okay, that truly is the genuine truth. Pussy for that. What did I do to and you? Then I, I call him a pussy, but like, come on. You fuck. Like, I, I thought he demoted me, so I was like, why did I get demoted? And later on, he says I was inactive, and I prior uploaded four days ago. So that's why I went off, and that's why I got mad, um, because I wasn't inactive whatsoever. And that in my mind, I thought I got demoted for inactivity. What the hell? But Yikes, I didn't do anything to you, young man. What do you mean? Did you take it away? What a scum. Yikes. So he's kind of talking like LOX Alex. I guess this is kind of where he's in a more of a mellow mood. He's talking like LOX Alex. Um, we'll get to a, a couple of the other timestamps later here, um, but bro, basically what you're saying is that this 25k, almost 25k, I think it's at 23 right now, YouTuber, um, basically, I would almost go to the extent of abusing uh, s probably some of you guys who are watching the video right now. Uh, Didn't abuse anyone, man. He donated an extreme amount of money, and um, I decided to give back, like I said, one-sided arguments is all you provide. Um, I just, I just want to let you guys know. I was an admin on Facebook Belt for a short time. I'm a reputable guy. And um, I'm not saying that that should guarantee me a thumbs up on the video, but if you guys want to leave a like, go ahead. Um, I'll promise you this. I'm a moral guy. I'm not going to use you guys for money. I'm not going to ask you guys. See, Brady, you're not using them for money. When you put a pre-roll in front of your videos, I got the same offer, 1,000 views for $5, okay? So you said you're not using them for money. I turned that offer down. Why would I ever want to do that? Okay, you say you love vape, but whatever, okay? But you you put the pre-roll in your videos and you make money off of what they do or off of the views that you get. Obviously, you need money to live. You need money to do everything. Money's a necessity. But you saying that you don't 
use your channel to gain monetary value is a straight up lie. Nice to, you know, what, you know, just give me money just because, and then I'll, you know, I'm going to go sneak off on Faithful and unban you, or, you know, sneak off on Bill and unban you. It's just not going to happen. Um, I'm just going to say this. It's despicable, and it's something that should not be tolerated by the community and the belt. I mean, Solium, as, as much as... Like I said, if you know, if you actually um, covered the whole story, then you wouldn't be saying this, but... I uh, have argued with him sometimes. He, he's the owner. He makes money off belt. It's his server. He gets the profit. Not we in here, BB. Did we in here, BB, create belt? Like I said, I can pay him, and um, obviously I didn't pay him. But um, obviously, I was a bit in the wrong. I'm not. I'm gonna take full blame for that, like I said. But um, in my mind, it wasn't that big of a deal, and um, I could have paid them the money and just left Fell and had and be done with it. You know what I'm saying? You didn't. You know that if I was the owner of products and you know my admin was selling ranks, I would be extremely disappointed. I'm sure some of you guys have maybe tried owning a server, maybe not HEF, or maybe you know put together a land server. But think of put yourself in, in in the shoes of an owner. If you guys owned a server and one of your staff members is trying to um, literally take money away from you, that's not cool. Um, like I said, not- I didn't advertise it as I'm selling on bands, so I'm not trying to take their money. The worst part. Um, he's, he's incredibly, bro, go ahead. He's incredibly toxic. Um, yeah. I mean, I know he's been around for a while and he took a break and now he's back, sadly, but, um, I, you know, I don't really have Had to add that in there, bro. Nice one. Have a problem with anything you know i can handle that but the problem where i had was uh when he came and he i noticed that he was actually using our player base to actually make prop like profit off of it and that's kind of where i drew the line that's why i wanted to contact you about it like i said i've explained it a million times you know i don't really and also i explained this to bro in team speak um many times we talked for 20 minutes i even i have it all recorded and uh, bro still doesn't tell the right side of the story when um, I, we talked for so long, I have a recording of it. I could post that if you want. I don't get how we can talk for that long, and I can make it clear. I, I had to restate it like 10 times. The exact story that I said is real, and it happened. And Bro knows that, and he still went on here and told a one sided argument. Channel or anything, you know, especially other YouTubers, they just do that to make themselves feel better. But player base, or our, our player base, and uh, you pretty much use them for money and profitable things. I mean, I mean, I think you can agree, see, Ray, that's pretty messed up, you know, that's something that has to be uh, brought up and uh, shown to the community, you know, just not to mess up this guy. I know you guys aren't victims. So my, my, the viewers who are watching my mental alert right now, I hope you guys... Nobody's see. victims, man. Absolutely no one, because I didn't advertise to sell them. Subscribe. Um, if that's the captain, I'm not releasing your pack, man. You can release it, homie. I said this because I was PvPing, it was a short thing, and this is all they included, and they include a little bit longer. But I'll play for you guys a clip of when I was done PvPing, and I explained it um, in my own words with having to actually think about what I'm saying. That's literally such a waste. I spent so many hours working on it. You spent so many hours on it, guys. I literally had 20 bomb, 200 bomb, hold yeah, up. I'll I mean, uh, from what Fassi told me, done. is that uh, he spent like a really long time like editing it for him and all that stuff. And then yeah. all he did was try and do If you look in the stream chat, you, too, you can see what Fassi says. He doesn't say anything like bad or he doesn't trash talk or anything. He literally just says, you know, like, yo, man, can you, uh, you can look at my pack or whatever. And that's, that's, his, that's the response that he gets. I mean, uh, honestly, I don't, I don't know how you could treat somebody in that literally makes a pack for you for free, you know, just out of the kindness of their heart, you is, know, and does I'm that at, shit. Yeah, I'm at the 32nd up. mark. Is there anything else that I, that I should be seeing right now in this, in this unlisted? Uh, did you go video? to one minute, minute and three seconds? Well, we're going to go, we yeah, let's go ahead and get there, guys. Literally spent hours yeah. working on it. That's, that's like when, uh, okay. you look in the chat, too. All right, I'm going to go ahead and play it. I think that it was good. Ask him if you wanted anything changed. What are we doing right now, by the way? Just imagine making a pack, spending so much time on it. They say it's good. Say they're gonna release it and then don't. A massable cross. Thanks for the sub, guys. One sub away from twenty thousand one hundred. Literally so disrespectful. Pastor Captain, I'm thinking peeing there, dick fuck. <laughs> okay, I probably shouldn't have said that. Let's be honest. I'm sorry. I honestly apologize for that. But um, I was peeing, so I didn't want to explain it all right away. Um, and that's why I explain it later in one second, but obviously they're not going to show the clip. Um, I will show it for you guys. Okay. 
You literally had me that's make it, despicable. yeah, and you made it, and everyone hated it. What am yeah, I that's, supposed that's to what do? I was trying. Everyone, honestly, I was in my stream, and I said opinions on the pack, and they said the ores were bad. They said the pick looks bad. They said the colors were bad, and I, he would have to redo the entire pack, which would be another week of work, another two days of work, and uh, that would be a lot more work. So in the clip, I explain it, and uh, to, one, hold on one second, yeah. I'll show it. Everyone said it was bad. Like I'm sorry, okay. I honestly did say that pretty disrespectful. That's my bad, but I explain it in a second. What a complete dick. So now, wait. What a complete. Yeah, so now I will play the um, the actual clip of when I said it. So, right here, um... Jesus, fuck. I, apolog I apologize, and Nothing I say it's my you, bad. Man. They didn't like the orders, and I didn't come to you to change it. It's my fault. I said it was my fault. Get this kid, get this kid, what? Fastly, okay, I'm gonna mute the music, okay? Then I mute up, and I mute the music, and I start to explain, which obviously they, they didn't show this. See Brady, one-sided arguments. Pack was apparently bad, and I didn't want to have you redo it because I thought that was too much waste of your time. So I just didn't have you talk about it and no, nothing. So you can release it, you can change it, you can do whatever you want, and I didn't want to have you the stress of redoing it. And I feel like a dick asking you to redo it and stuff. Okay? So I'm not trying to be a dick. I'm just saying, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, fuck. Okay. Just trying to mark a PP, man. You can release the pack i didn't want to be a dickhead and come have you change everything and stuff so you can release it on your own man so if he had to go back and change everything that could be another couple days work on his end so i was trying to save him time he can release it on his own channel he can gain from it he still made a pack it's not like the pack's going to waste okay it can go on his channel uh, i'm sorry fastly crafted for actually coming at you the way i did in the start but i re-explained myself after i was done pvping um, when i can actually talk and think and process what i'm saying and that's the genuine truth um, I didn't want to have him redo it. He can still release it on his channel. So, his, the pack didn't go to waste. Okay, so. See, Brady, if you would have shown this, then uh, your argument would have been, wouldn't have would have been one-sided, and it would have been good. But, you gotta dig a little deeper, man. So, let's continue with the video. Asshole. That is a definition of, and I, I, you know, Eddie the Pro has a pretty big stick up his ass, but this is another guy who, who, Obviously, see Brady. If you kept watching the video and you dug a little bit deeper, um, you would find out what what I just showed everyone. Has no appreciation for people who try to help. And like I said, I, I apologize for. Obviously, I came off a little arrogant at the start, but I was PvP and kind of not in the right mindset. And once I actually thought about what to say and um, how to put it and how to present it, then that's what that's what I said, and that's the genuine truth. I'll get into Eddie Pro in future videos. Eddie the Pro hates Natsu because Natsu went to him asked for a YouTuber rank and offered to upload videos for free trying to grow Arcane. And Eddie the Pro said, hey, Natsu, fuck you. I don't want you on my server because you're annoying and you're young. That's basically what happened. And this guy is almost worse. We in here, BB, is an asshole. He's the dick, actually. He calls Fastly Crafted a dick fuck. No, I'm sorry. Here's a wake-up call, buddy. You're the dick fuck, okay? And I don't really care if I lose monetization because I don't do YouTube for money. So oh, see, Brady, you don't do YouTube for money. Why do you put a vape pre-roll on every single video? Like I said, I got the same offer. 1,000 views for $5. Okay, I, know, I denied it because I don't want to have that in front of my videos. Like, there's no point. And you're blatantly saying that you don't do YouTube for money. Okay, like I said, everyone needs money to live and whatnot. But you can get it other ways and not exploiting your fans you're straight up exploiting your fans in this video by having the vape pre-roll and you're saying i'm exploiting my fans when you don't even know the whole story and i've told you the whole story which it makes you look bad you say you don't let's replay it of course we in here bb is an asshole he's the dick actually he calls fast listen up the listen dick up fuck. right here no i'm sorry here's a wake-up call buddy you're the dick fuck listen up okay and i don't really care if i lose monetization because i don't do youtube for money so i'll say how many ever customers I you don't do youtube for money that's weird take the vape pre-roll off i'm sorry if your families are watching this but we in here bb is a dick fuck and i'm saying that publicly that he is treating my friends and other YouTubers like this because they are trying to do something for him. Not cool. It's not appreciated. And frankly, once again, I explained it. You know what I'm saying? You have one half of the argument that um, you put up on your channel, and the other half that's gone because it's the real argument and the real facts, and you don't show it. Kind of weird. I, I hope that he privates his videos and he doesn't upload because I don't want to see someone in this community thrive and survive. 
Yeah, you know what's crazy too is that he said that like on his stream. Can you imagine like what he's like off camera? Like, isn't that crazy? Like, that's... hey, bro, I'm gonna pop a little screenshot shot up right now. Um, this is honestly, I'm not trying to send hate to you, but you can't be hip hypocritical yourself. All right. That's what I thought was just wild. Like, I don't, I don't know how you talk to somebody like that, especially somebody that took the time to make a pack for you. Like. I don't really make packs, but I'm friends with Latency and a few other pack makers, and from my understanding, it takes a long ass time. Yes, to it took a long time, and he can release it on his channel. He has 10k subs. His sub was, subs would have loved that pack. Okay, it can be it's universal. It can be released wherever. Pack, you know. So, just to hear that is kind of. Uh... It's a disappointment, and um, it's sad that people have made it this far and still continue to treat people like that. I hope you guys agree with most of everything I said. Um, it's not cool. This guy is not cool. and he They agreed with you because you showed not the entire argument. I'll say it and say it time and time again. It's the fact. Shouldn't be looked up as some role model. Um, you know how I am about the YouTube community. I'm, I'm not trying to be a role model, okay? I provide YouTube content, and if you like it, you like it. You don't, you don't. I love a lot of them, and I hate a lot of them. Um, but, you know, other than that, I do want to thank you guys for your view today, each and every one of you, especially if you guys have liked the video. Like Mind man alert, this is where I want to thank Bro for coming to me with, with this. I think it's important. Um, even though, you know, this isn't a paid stream or anything, I wanted to do it literally just because I felt it's it not paid enough. Uh, you put a vape pre roll. Weird. To, to communicate. So if you guys have any stories, make sure you guys follow me on Twitter, DM me there. And um, other than that, thank you guys for watching. Well, I gave you guys everything I can. I gave you my genuine thoughts, genuinely what happened. Um, I wouldn't lie about it. I swear on my life. Everything I said is actually what happened. There's no point to lie. There really isn't. And um, we kind of showed what C. Brady's character is like and uh, showed that he do he has one-sided arguments and um, showed a little bit. I'm not trying to hate. Like I really am not trying to hate, but I'm just going to point out the blatant, blatant, obvious things that are happening in this video, okay? So, um... Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope it cleared up some stuff. Um, don't go hate on their channels. Uh, this is not what this is about. I'm not trying to spread hate. I'm trying to just show you what happened in the real sense, okay? So, hope you guys enjoyed, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one.